What's up guys, in today's video, oh, shit, we're gonna try not to kill ourselves. Let me do that again. Did you, did you end up getting flying clothes? What is up guys, in today's video, we're gonna be cooking up something really nice. Actually, I'm not, but this guy is right here, Outdoor Chef Life. And uh, we were all out here in the wild blue yonder catching some pretty cool stuff. You're gonna have to stay tuned and see what we all caught, what I caught, and contributing to <laughs> Taku's amazing donation sensation Shirashi Bowl. So before we get to that, check it out, see what I caught. See you there. Having surf launched in a while, making some adjustments, repositioning some weight to uh, counteract the forces of the waves. I'm a little rusty. First time in the Outback in a year. Thank you! Whew. Uh, my twigs and berries! It's too early for this! All right, what is up guys? Today's video, I'm doing something I haven't done in quite a long time, and that's surf launching, not just surf launching, but surf launching my Outback, which I really haven't used in forever, ever since I kind of went electric um, and have been using my inflatable with the family. Um, you know, the Outback really is just kind of hung out in my yard. I don't have much space inside to store it, so I wrap it as tight as I can and uh, keep the spiders and rats out of it. Rats are my biggest fear, because if I was a rat, and I found the whole of this of course I would want to nest in it and I mean this plastic they'll go through it in like two seconds like butter so fortunately everything's checking out pretty good pretty excited to be out on the water and I'm doing it on today's product today's rod Kingswell or Kingswell however you want to pronounce it thanks very much for sponsoring this vid and I'm hoping to put something juicy something big a keeper on this telescopic rod. I think this rod is going to travel with me a little bit this year. Uh, let's see if we can travel to the big bite. Here we go. Oh, really? Oh, look at this guy's going down. Yeah, I'm doing all right. Did you just What'd you catch? That? Nice. Yeah, I just snagged it on the way over. Okay. Uh, put it back okay. down. Yeah, he's going down. All right, here we go. You know the drill. Sling cod on my targets. Live bait. This one was a croaker that I snagged on the way over. He stole my halibut bait. Well, he's going to turn into ling cod. It's the price you pay of admission on the ish roller coaster. Here we go. Yeah, it's beautiful. Oh, fish on. Good one. Oh, yeah. That's a nice one. Fish on. Let's go. Oh, it's a good one. Woo! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. I found your ling, Danny. Woo! Ooh, ooh, look out, look out. Yeah, look out. Can you switch the other Oh, Nick, get out of the way. Nick, get out of the way, you bastard. Get away. Yeah, it's a big one. Move, Nick! Where's that gaff? Nick's got to get out of the way! <laughs> ah, he nosed me! <laughs> Let's go! Woo! Called it! Let's go, baby! Let's go, baby! Oh! Let's go, baby! Let's go. I don't know. It's a good one. I'm thinking maybe maybe like low to mid 30. Oh, 
Oh, the Carlos Gaff. Let's go. Ooh, that's a big one. Right here, he's gonna go. No, there he goes. It's a big ling. It's a big boy. It's probably like low teens. Let's go on that kingfish. Yep, that kingfish that tried to steal my. Oh, yeah! Nice! Woohoo! Aren't you glad you followed me now? I am! Yeah, baby! On the Kingswell Travel Rod. There we go. Got it. On the croaker that followed me all the way here, stole my bait, decided to jump on. Bang! Got him! Thanks for the spot, Nick. <laughs> Appreciate it. Oh, look at Oh, look at him coughing up stuff. Ugh. Oh, mutant. Oh, mutant. Ugh. Nick, you need some bait? Uh, no. <laughs> Check this out. Look, a zombie greenling he just spit up. Crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. Congratulations, dude. Woo! Hell yeah. Nick convinced me not to bring my stringer, so I don't have any safe way of really tying him down. So I'm going to bonk him and then bleed him. And then drag them around. Okay, yeah, I could use it. Hey, thanks for the gaff, Carlos. Appreciate it. This one's for you. All right. Wait a minute. Hold on. I came over here to steal Danny's fish. I got it. These guys snuck up on <laughs> with its new four-stroke. All quiet. Adam hooked up. He was quiet. Oh, dude, oh, these twins. are like twinsies. Yours is pretty fat, though. It's got something in there. Well, he, yeah, he coughed up a greenling. Dude, it's like the same fish. I think uh, Adam's is like an inch Here. longer, but yours is wider. Okay. Did you measure yours? No, I don't have a... I mean, I have a measuring device on board. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we'll call, we'll, we'll call it a... Oh, right, yeah, can you measure it? We're going by weight or girth or length? Keep in mind, he's on a boat. Not even his boat. A boat with a brand new motor, so that gives me like that gives me like a 10 inch. Right. We'll give it to Ish on this one. Hey, I'll, I'll take I'll take any victory I can get. <laughs> Good job, man. Yeah. In the kayak, you get bonus points for that. I'll take it. All right, coming up to crab pot. Number one, really excited to see if we got anything here. I haven't caught crab here, I don't think ever. I never launch pots uh, out here because I mean, I don't fish this area very often. Really excited to see if there's any crab out here. I mean, it's not like an overnight soaker, everything. It's late in the season, um, but you know, when it's late in the season, oftentimes people are sick of crab and there's like hardly any pressure. I think I'm the only two pots uh, out here right now. So it might be that well, uh, low pressure means there's more males running around for me. Uh, I don't know too much about migration patterns or anything like that, but I do know that um, uh, sometimes the males kind of stick together. So if there's one, there's a lot. And I'm hoping that that translates to a lot of crab. Whoa. Oh my God. Oh my God. Wow! Holy, holy, holy moly! Oh. oh! Oh my God! Oh! Wow! Oh! Oh shoot! Oh! Oh my God! There's so there's so many crab in here. Oh, but they're, <laughs> damn dude, they're like, they're all female, I think. Shoot, wow. Okay, all right. Uh. Huh? <laughs> Just one male. Just need one male. <laughs> Look at that thing. Oh. There's, there's some big ass rocks. There's some 
Some big, they're all rock crabs. What the hell? Is that one on top? Oh, weird. It's like kind of stuck weird. Oh. Look at this guy. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, do you guys want him? Yeah. Okay. Oh, maybe there's a couple of, uh, oh, that might be a male dungy right there. Cool. Alrighty. I normally don't keep red rock crabs, but hey, if someone like Taku says he's going to cook up something, and if he could throw these in, why not? You don't complain when somebody else is going to make fruit for you. Let's take these ashore and let's see what Taku's going to throw down. Can't wait. All right, we made it off the water and man, I was able to contribute the crab. Pretty cool to contribute to, you know, something bigger than myself. Thanks to Kingswell for uh, sponsoring that catch, frankly, and uh, happy to share with my boy, Nick. So I got the crab, I got the bluefin that uh, was gifted to me. I'm happy to gift it to, you know, somebody that actually knows what to do with it. And uh, man, it's coming together. We're gonna have to check out Taku's video for the full cookup, full assembly of this big Hiroshi bowl. And uh, I'll see you at the end when I get to dig in. I'm super stoked. Thank you so much, Taku. You're welcome. My bluefin tuna, my crab going to good use. Oh yeah. Happy to contribute. Oh yeah, thank you. Adam, thank you for the halibut. Thank you for whoever brought the salmon and say thank you for the yellowtail. Safeway, thank you for the fish eggs. <laughs> <laughs> I have a ginger in here too, so you guys can take it. Awesome, man. Wow. Wow. That's amazing. Real crab. Mm -hmm. Crab in there. Oh yeah. Get a huge old. Get in there. Oh my gosh. Holy smokes, you can get. Holy oh, man. there we go. <laughs> all, all the flavors in one. Here we go. Oh my gosh. That's a doctor. Doctor. That's a doctor. I gotta do this next one. I gotta do this next one. Alright, guys, I'm trying some fresh salmon here. I netted that salmon. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks guys for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Thanks, Taku, Adam, Zilo, Steven, Vince, Danny. We'll see you in the next one. All right.